So here's what's happening in Whitfield County Schools, a new cell phone policy that bans phones and other communication devices from being used in classrooms. They're trying to prevent disruption, but there's a lot more to the story, as Karen Aguilar tells us. The new policy would make students place their cell phones into one of these pockets in the beginning of every class, but they can, however, use their cell phones during lunch or in the hallways. A new change at Whitfield County High Schools. No cell phones or other communication devices during class for students. They'll have to be put in these pockets instead. You can never tell when there's going to be a gun, you know, a shooting, and they may need to call someone, you know. You, you just can't never tell. Marlena Wilson is one of several concerned parents commenting on the Whitfield County Schools post. Worried about school safety amid school shootings making headlines. I mean, I'd be terrified. You know, to even get that phone call. I mean, me as a parent. The Whitfield County School Superintendent, Dr. Mike Eoton, says they have installed telephones in every classroom in case of emergencies like those. They say the purpose of the policy change is to improve student learning, saying in a statement, despite school rules that require phones to be put away during class, cell phones have become a major distraction in our classrooms. I mean, I, I can understand, you know, the whole you know, having the phones out there in class, they're not paying attention, blah, blah, blah. But I feel if them phones are in their book bags or they ain't got them out, then them phones shouldn't be taken. We weren't able to get a parent who supported the change on camera, but several others on social media welcomed the new change, saying they trust the school system and students should follow the rules. The rules of the school system shows the consequence for not obeying the new change, and it's up to the administration. It can range from counseling to even suspension. The superintendent of Whitfield County School says the new changes will take place on the first day of school, which is Friday, August 5th. Reporting in Dalton, Karen Aguilar, Local 3 News.